Hey guys, it's Jolie. I thought it might be fun to do a sort of pet update for 2016, um, in part because if you've been here a little bit, you know that the very tail end of 2014 through about November of 2015 was pretty much um, the year the pets died. Uh, we had a really bad year. We lost, I think, we lost a dog, a guinea pig, four chinchillas. Okay, Celeste, Nikki, Tuli, Kiki. Yeah, four chinchillas, which is insane. I have this feeling I'm forgetting one still. But anyway, this year, so far, cross our fingers, it's been nearly 12 months. We have a 100% survival rate so far, and we've added, since last year, um, two dogs. And then we still have the two chinchillas, and we have a guinea pig, and I just thought it'd be fun to make a little video um, showing you all of them and just their little antics. Um, uh, that aside, I have a bunch of pet footage for you, which I'm sure you're excited to see. I've got the corgis, I've got the chinchillas, I've got the guinea pig. I have the guinea pig who gives no, we'll say, craps in the world. She makes lots of crap, but you know, I mean, you'll, you'll see. This guinea pig does not care if a dog is up in her face. Does not care. And it's hilarious. She's just like, what? What are you going to do to me? What? Bring it. And Tato being new, I don't think has ever seen a cage small animal. So his part of his day is just sitting there and staring at her. What you doing? What you doing? What you doing? Holy crap, it moved! Yeah, that's, that's Tato in a nutshell. All right, I am going to stop you here and get to the fun stuff, which is the animals. So I'll see you very soon. Bye. Hi there. <laughs> Saying hi is not an invitation to bark. Yeah. So anyway, I think I've introduced him before. This is Landy. Hi, Landy. And this is our new guy. This is Tato, which is short basically for potato, though his official name is Tato. Um, he was named by his original family because as a puppy, he looked like a tater tot. Apparently, so we call him Tato, Tater, Tate. Um, hi, yeah, he is um, quite overweight if you compare the two. He's got probably about 15 pounds or so to get off, and we're working on it. He's on a diet and he's been walking. Oh look, they both got the feet. And Landy's been here since April. Hi. And that's short for Landiscog, and he sees me, so I must rub the belly. Rub the belly. See if I can do this without falling over. Yay, belly. <laughs> belly. Yeah, so Tato's only been here for a few days, and Landy's been here since April. Um, they're, they're adjusting. Um, Landy was not initially very amused. I'm not sure he's still very amused at the idea of us getting a second dog. Um, however, they're working on it. There's a little bit of power struggles going on. Um, so a little bit of growling, no fighting. A little bit of stealing each other's chewies and competing for attention but they've been much more settled today than they have been. So that's good. That's good. You're good, Corgis. So, yeah. And he loves everybody. And he lets the kids drag him around wherever they want. So that makes uh, my four-year-old especially very happy. And it takes some of the heat off to Mr. Landeskog here since he doesn't like being dragged around quite as much. But, um, yeah, Tato's just very chill about it. So those are those guys. Where's your cookie? Where's the cookie? Where is it? Where's the cookie? Where's the cookie? Where's your cookie? 
Oh, there it is! Yay! It's double derp time. We are attempting to go for a walk on the same leash and wander around the park. Um, so far they've gotten tangled about 10 times, even though they have a swivel leash and have almost tripped me um, about the same number of times. And then this guy didn't want to go across the street for some reason and I had to drag him. Oh, and there goes a roll. Hi. Is that a good roll? Yeah. And sometimes they walk nice like that with the little swinging hineys and sometimes they split off and get confused. That's why I like the swivel leash, they can go around each other like that without the tangles. All right, thinking time. How are you gonna get around it? How are you gonna get around it? How are you gonna get around it? Come on. Somebody figure it out. Wow, we're just gonna sit here. Somebody go around the other side of the tree. How about you? No, no, no potato. How about you? Come here. Mandy, come here. All right, let's try this again. And around. Okay. All right, we're going the other way. Come on. Come on, clear the tree. Clear the tree. There we go. We missed the tree. It's a guinea pig. Yet Landy already knows. Don't mess with the guinea pig. The guinea pig is not afraid of you. What exactly do you think is going to happen here, Kato? Are you still breathing, dog? Hi, Muffins. Hi, Muffins. Hi. Yeah, hi. Hi to you too. Billy. Hey, Trixie. Trixie, come here. No. Oh, I see. You're, you're a big scary dog when the cage is closed. When it's open, you just stare. Hi. Hey, you. I see you. Uh huh. Hold on. One handed. You want a treat? Nom, 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 nom. You, you dropped it. Go get it. 
Go find it. Are you smart enough to find it? You found it. You're the smartest chinchilla in the world. Hi. Okay. Sorry. Eva, you can have one too. I know. You're too shy for me to open the door. But there you go. There's Eva. There's Eva too. Yeah. Will you quit having beef with the guinea pig? Hey. Yeah, you tell him, Landy. Landy, you've lived with the guinea pig for like half a year already. Tato's new to the game. Okay, since we're doing cute. Yay! I can put more dust in there. Good dust bath? Are you getting fluffier? What is up with you and that climbing business? You know, walk on your wheel? No? Darn it, because that's funny. Hi. Do you want something? Oh look, somebody else wants something. Hi. Hi Eva. Look at that belly. I'm gonna get your belly. I got your belly. I'm gonna get your belly. Belly. Oh, okay. We'll get treats. <laughs> Hi. I can pet him too. Here. Yes. Hey, Tato. No, it's Landy. You dogs.